I don't want to give the impression that since overall financial situation of UN is sound, as I said. Therefore, we have the capacity to spend money for other purposes. This is a completely different issue. Budget is tight. That, uh, this is the time I'm going to, uh, going to basically explain you cash, how much cash we have to spend. That I'm talking about. But Secretary General has no authority to spend any single dollar which is not authorized by General Assembly. General Assembly is, as a voting charter, this uh, authority to allow us to spend, approve expenditure. We don't have a luxury of going anything beyond that. So there have to be basis for our spending. And as you know, that tight budget is imposed upon member states. We are very, very tight for organization. Because organization totally depend on those member states which are capacity and willingness to provide troops and police equipment to carry out peacekeeping operations. So UN all then for troop cost, equipment and others. Uh, the outstanding payment at the end of 2012, means last year, amounted to $525 million. As you can see here, 525 in this outstanding payment member state. As of now, it's 795 million. But between now and the end of the year, we're going to make serious effort to reduce it, to pay more to those countries. Except the regular budget. This is the total. A total of 1.8768, 1 billion, 868 million dollar has been assessed for this, uh, the repairing, renovation of this building here. Uh, you can see impressive uh, payment by member state. We have received 1.1 billion 867, means 99.9 percent .9 have been paid. It's almost 99. I think it's uh, fairly clear that member state takes this uh, capital master plan seriously. Beginning of the year, every year, January, Secretary General, and uh, will uh, will also have a. Uh,